This is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non-stop hype all week long. And now for the action. Hello and welcome, and I must say the weather couldn't be any better. It's a very pleasant night for football here at the Etihad Stadium. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City up against Tottenham Hotspur. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And Spurs will go with this starting 11. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Matt Doherty plays with Reggie Long in the fullback positions. Hugh Min Son plays with Lucas Moura out wide. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. Enjoy the match. And the contest begins. And Sterling has it. Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. Romero. Matt Doherty. Beautiful pass. And it's held up by Lucas, anticipating that the support will arrive. Lost possession. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Really bright looking attack. Well, defending always has to be a team effort. Good piece of covering. And a poor ball. Promising attack, this. But that's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. had it where he wanted it a good and fair challenge and played through by Sterling. Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. Mares. Now Son. Kane. Showing a real will to win the ball. 
on a pass that lacks quality. Kevin De Bruyne. De Bruyne threading it through. Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, as you can see here, it all starts with a perfectly weighted ball in behind the defenders. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So back underway, and a wake-up call for Tottenham, perhaps. Take it away. In behind for him to chase. And a goal! An end-to-end -end game! And they weren't behind for long! Well, here we can see it again. And no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here. Deal with the danger, otherwise that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Rodri. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. De Bruyne. The ball with Rodri. Walker. And it might appeal to Raheem Sterling, you know. Well, desperately close to going in that time. This is a message for Benjamin Walker. Benjamin Walker, can you please come to reception? Your wife is waiting for you. This is a free kick forthcoming. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. They're showing good defensive judgment. quality defending Lucas excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward Matt Doherty Harry Kane Joao Cancelo well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball, but without really creating too many chances, which when you look at the players out on the pitch, it's really disappointing. They need to play with far more urgency to win this game. Can they find a gap in the defence? Foden, body on the line. Reguilon. Mares.
Ruben Diaz. Well, he fancied his chances, but shame about the finish, ultimately. Kevin De Bruyne Walker now Foden Fernando Silva can he put them ahead goalkeeper getting in the way superb save Kevin De Bruyne with the corner that's very decisive goalkeeping Rodri, brilliantly blocked, and the danger cleared. And that's an important intervention. And the counter looks on here, options available. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Not enough cut and thrust, but they keep possession. And space to cross it. The first half here comes to an end. Well, in a word for Raheem Sterling so far, positive. Well, I thought he had a very good first 45 minutes. He scored a good goal, was a constant threat and looked dangerous whenever he was on the ball. I'm sure he'd be the key player in the second half. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. A Spurs free kick it's going to be. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Routine, really. And City have possession once more. Ruben Diaz. De Bruyne now. And return to De Bruyne. Oh, good use of the ball. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Spurs to make a personnel switch now. Delivered into the box. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Well, threat averted. Really good interception. He made it look simple, really. Fabier. Kane. And Fabier with it. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Well, given the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Superb opportunity squandered. Joao Cancelo. The ball with Rodri. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Joao Cancelo. And the keeper has possession of it.
Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Mares. An utterly disappointing cross. Goal kick. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Number 27, Lucas Moura. Coming onto the pitch, 21, Dijan Kulisevsky. And now, passing it through. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Walker. De Bruyne now. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Not a poor ball and easy for the keeper. Romero Winks Harry Kane Harry Winks now and the pass could do damage he's in position very alert defending to put a stop to the chance well the attack finally comes to nothing and the keeper has it Rodri on to Silva Looking away patiently, looking for an opening. And the right place to cut out the pass. Winks. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Doherty. Fabier. Harry Winks now. Beautifully disguised ball. Save. Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. Well, the atmosphere is electric at the moment, but can City reward their fans with a winner? You sense it might be coming. And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. And given the defender's touch, the referee says City, corner. City, City. A change in the offing for City. City. And he's fired over the corner and fisted away. Intelligent threaded pass here. Great save at this stage. Well, that would have been the winner for sure. It's a great save. And Manchester City will go to their bench. And there's the delivery. In the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Five minutes to go. All even, but will it stay that way? Mares. Top class defending. Kane. Retaining possession proving difficult. Alexander Zinchenko. Well, it would have been a chance, but the run was mistimed. Offside. A change on the offing for City.
Davinson Sanchez. Really nice ball. Javier. Oh, it's a penalty. And what an opportunity for them, perhaps, to win it. Well, he's also showing him the yellow card. Yeah, he had to make the challenge, but it was always going to be risky, and so it proved. to give them the lead here. In it goes! A well-taken penalty! Well, let's look at that once again, because penalties don't get much better than this. Struck high into the corner, it was never in doubt that he would score. Having conceded, Manchester City know they've got to come up with a response. And there's the final whistle, the big headline defeat for City. What did you make of this? Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance.